and inches from the official storm reports. A lot of snow drifts. And Steve, wow, that snow is yeah. blowing around. Right? This is uh, this is kind of painful, Amy, at times. I'm not going to lie. I worked in Nevada, right, for three years, desert. And you have that wind when it picks up. It picks up the sand and it, and it whips you in the face. That's what it feels like with this snow. It's so dry. And, and listening to all the different reports that we have every, with everyone in the field, it's a similar case as it is dry snow. It just starts to fall apart and dissipate once the wind hits it. And it's whipping around the wind here in Shirley. New York is right around 40, gusting to 50 miles per hour at a time. That's why we're in that blizzard warning until 7 p.m. Now, County Executive Steve Pallone of Suffolk County, he just had a press conference about an hour ago, and he was saying, we're in the thick of it right now. The worst of it's going to go until at least 2 p.m. And then hopefully we'll see those snowfall rates diminish a little bit. But he says this blizzard warnings until 7 p.m. We're asking you to stay off the road. So far, accidents in Suffolk County and on Long Island have been minimal because people have been heeding the warning. I want to bring you in and show you what's behind me. That is Bellport Bay. And normally it's stagnant conditions, calm waters, because it's a bay, right? It's actually the wind impact is forcing these two to three foot waves down out into the Atlantic. It's not even coming on shore. It's now going north to south because of the wind direction. And then you'll look at the different coloration. It's almost a frothy mix. It is so cold that the water's trying to condense. When we arrived last night, it was so calm that the water could, and we had some ice that was accumulating on top of the bay. That has fallen apart because of the wave action, and now you have this frothy mix as it continues to condense. Remember last hour, I started to walk across this yard, and we're talking about how it's difficult to walk because of how deep the snow is. But remember, my tracks are gone now. That shows you how quickly the snow replenishes. We're talking about two-inch uh, you know, snow rates right now per hour. At times it can be higher than that. And then we have our French Bulldog as our measurement right now. We only have one ear that's poking out. I was joking with Craig on Twitter saying he can barely hear you over the snow. And we had 10 inches before. We're starting to continue to pile up the snow here. I have my yardstick and get all the way up to six feet. We're not anticipating that, don't worry. It may get to two feet towards Montauk here, <laughs> a foot and a half. But when we start to measure this for you, we're still consistently right at 10 inches, just maybe above that as we continue to pick this up. But it is difficult to measure the snow. We're trying to do this the best we can in the middle of the yard. I'm Amy Freeze. Welcome to Fox Weather's YouTube page. We have more great videos on the way, so make sure to subscribe to stay updated on all things weather.